I mean, it is pretty cool. Welcome to Man Cave Media. Today we are discussing something a little bit ridiculous, uh, in my opinion. Um, I'm a little bit late to the game to this, uh, so I wasn't going to talk about it, but I have in the box here the uh, popcorn buckets for Alien Romulus that were exclusives to Regal Cinemas. And I know that all of the movie theaters were doing their own exclusive uh, popcorn buckets for that movie, but for whatever reason, the ones from Regal have gone nuts with their pricing. And the one alien head from Cinemark has also gone pretty nuts with pricing. But none more than the face hugger glass container from Regal, which I have here in the box. So I'm going to give it... I am super late to the game on this. I wasn't even going to do a video on them. But I noticed recently that pricing for these has gone through the roof. Like, astronomical what people are asking for these now. And it's kind of nuts when I see what prices people are getting for them on eBay, and I decided that I should talk about them and give you guys a look. I know there's other videos out there already, but I want you to understand what it is you're buying when you're placing the bids for these on eBay, because uh, since I got mine, uh, I was not able to get mine from Regal, by the way. I did have to go uh, through a third-party seller, unfortunately, but I got a really good price for mine. Uh, I paid a small penalty over retail. Uh, and since I bought mine, it's been um, it's been almost two weeks now since I bought mine. Prices have soared. I I'm really actually surprised that the person I bought these from didn't just decide not to ship them and cancel the sale because because I know that they're looking at listings on eBay right now and they realize that they lost a lot of money by selling them to me for what they did. But that being said, let's go ahead and start with the least valuable of the two, which is the Xenomorph head. So Cinemark also had a Xenomorph head, and it did look more correct to the one in the movie uh, than the Regal one. But the Regal one is cool because it's got his jaws open, and you can see the, the, the tongue mouth, the smaller mouth inside. So, I mean, it looks pretty cool. And the, the Cinemark one doesn't have, like, the neck. It's just, like, just the head only. So I kind of like the look of this one. I did try to get the Cinemark one as well, but prices went up too high. I waited too long. Uh, so it's way beyond now what I'm willing to pay for something like this. So uh, the lid opens like so. And then once you open it up, it's more of a traditional popcorn bucket because it's got the neck area. So you can like hold it like so and stick your bag of popcorn just like that. Uh, so the detail on this one is really nice. Uh, like I mentioned already with the uh, gaping mouth and like the the feel of it, the like the texture of it, it looks as if it is from the movie. Like, like uh, I don't know how else to explain it. It it looks really good. It looks really good. But to give you an idea of what it is you're buying, uh, if you have ever gone to Disneyland and you bought the Disneyland popcorn holders, this is very similar to that. So it is all plastic, obviously. It is pretty decent construction. It does say Alien Romulus on the bottom. But would I pay $80 or $90 for this? Hell no. Absolutely not would I pay that for this. That is ridiculous. And I say that or I ask that because that's what they're going for now on eBay. And it's, it's ridiculous. Don't pay $90 for this. This, it's ridiculous. I understand the want. It is really cool. But talking about ridiculous pricing, let's move to the next one. This. This is even more expensive right now on eBay. This is the face hugger popcorn container. And it's got Wheel and Yutani on one side and the broken glass on the other with the face hugger on the outside. Don't get me wrong, it is really cool. It's got the green lights. I mean, it's really cool. It's a cool collectible. Would I pay over $100 for this? Hell no. It's just a plastic container for food. That's all it is. I mean, it's well made. 
It's got some pretty good weight to it. The lid opens up like so. And as I mentioned, it's got the, the green LED lights. It's cool. But right now, this by itself is selling to close to $200 on eBay. And these are active auctions with bids and completed auctions that have gone for over $200. For this, this, don't do that. Don't do that. Like I said, I understand the want. It's cool. But, oh, my goodness. So to put it in perspective, I paid $129 for the pair. They were both new, still wrapped in the plastic. That puts it at $69 each, which um, obviously is more than retail. It's about, uh, I believe this one was $34 retail and this one was $29 or the other way around. I forget, no, this one, this one was more. Um, so obviously I did pay more than retail, but well under what they're selling for now. And from what I, from my opinion, uh, a much more reasonable price. So we'll go through a couple of these auctions really quick. Right now, the most ridiculous one by far, the most ridiculous one by far is this same set that I have right here. $285 plus $7.43 sense to ship it. There are 31 bids currently, 23 hours left on this auction. The bucket by itself, somebody has it right now, buy it now for 169 or best offer, uh, with free shipping at least. Here's another buy it now, $119 or best offer, $16 to ship it. Here's one by itself, it's still sealed in the plastic. This is how mine came as well. Um, like I said, I opened them because I wasn't planning on doing a video on these. Um, but here's one still sealed in the plastic, $122. It has 30 bids on it. There's an hour and 33 minutes left. The head by itself, for the, uh, the Regal variant anyway, $75. But look, this fool's charging 50 bucks to ship it. Come on, man. Here's another one, $73, but he only wants $9.69 to ship it. That's better. Buy it now for the face hugger bucket, $200. Like, come on, dude. Another exact same listing, so that means that this fool has more than one. Here's an auction style for the alien head. That's up to $61, eight bids. It's got three days left. $300 or best offer for the pair. I mean, I'm really tempted to relist these and sell them. Like, I can make some money off of this. I'm not going to, but I'm tempted. 52 bucks, 15 bids, five days left. Wow. Here's the uh, face hugger popcorn bucket and the cup for 150 bucks. There's no bids on that guy. Popcorn bucket just by itself, already opened out of the plastic, $234. Uh, I mean, come on, that is buy it now, though. So the ones that are on bid, uh, on auction, uh, I tend to believe those prices more. So $155. So between $155 and $200 um, just for this one. It's not worth it. In my opinion, it's not worth it. It is very cool, but... You can buy some pretty cool stuff. If you're an Alien fan, uh, you can buy some pretty cool stuff online for way less money than this. Um, for example, this. This guy was 50 bucks, I think, at Comic-Con. Pretty cool, right? 50 bucks. Another example, of course, is this. If you've got $200 burning a hole in your pocket and you're just itching to buy something alien related that's sold out, $200 on eBay, you can buy this right now. This is cool. This is worth $200. The box that you get with this thing, this is cool. This is worth it. <laughs> this is not. Just giving you an idea of things that you can get I mean, the counter. 
the sound effects. I don't want to throw darts everywhere. There we go. I mean, this is worth $200, okay? Not this. I'm looking for more examples. The, uh, the LV426. Uh, Cage-free eggs. I have them set up right there on the on the shelf. Forty bucks. These are really really cool, man. This is a really cool, like really funny um, alien accessory, like decoration. And they're actually kind of like if you've got action figures already, they're actually kind of to scale, so you can set them up and pose them uh, with face huggers. Really cool, 40 bucks. The Nendroid Xenomorph is currently $100. And I know it's small, but if you go back and watch my review of this thing, the detail on it is incredible. Well worth the money. If you're like totally itching to just buy some alien toys that are sold out, and you've got 200 bucks burning a hole in your pocket and you're looking at this. Don't buy this. Buy something like that. Way cooler. Get, get more bang for your buck. You can get several of these things for the price of this popcorn bucket. I know it's got lights. I know it's cool. It's got nice detail. Don't give a scalper 200 bucks for this thing. Come on, guys. You're better than that. Otherwise, I don't have a whole lot to say about them. As I mentioned, they're neat. Uh, they're, you know, if you're a fan of Alien, and especially if you like the new movie Romulus, you're gonna like this thing. It's cool. But the pricing that they're asking for on eBay right now, it ain't it, man. That Don't do that. My humble opinion. All right, that's all I have for this one. Thank you for tuning in and listening to my rant about overpriced Alien souvenirs. <laughs> Uh, hopefully you haven't already pulled the trigger on something like this and you can uh, use your money for something a little bit better. But um, anyways, uh, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I hope you have a great afternoon. Like always, thank you for watching and nuke the site from orbit because it's the only way to be sure. <laughs>